Hello, 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 and welcome to another video brought to you by the Machamp King. Today we are looking at Moonlit Hill, the perfect stadium that goes with Gardevoir EX. It gets Psychic into the discard, it heals for baby Gardevoir to do even more damage, and it bumps Path to the Peak, so three really good uses all in one card. So let's see exactly how well it works with this deck. The ability says once during each player's turn that player may discard a basic psychic energy from their hand in order to heal 30 damage from each of their Pokemon. So if your opponent does a little bit of damage on like Radiant Greninja or Manaphy or even Gardevoir that you want to put even more uh, energy on to do more damage, Moon the Hill works. It works on everything, not just Psychic Pokemon. So let's see the rest of the deck and see exactly how this can integrate perfectly in Gardevoir. So the rest of the deck looks like this. It looks like four Ralts, three Curlia with the Refinement ability, one Mirage Step Curlia, two Baby Gardevoirs uh, so that we can draw a couple extra cards even, two Gardevoir EX, one Manaphy for bench protection, one Cresselia to snipe things on the bench, uh, one Scream Tail to also snipe things on the bench, one uh, Radiant Greninja, and one Zacian. So the Zacian is in there because we want to use for a Seal Stone. We have one of those as well. We have three Iono, two Boss, two Worker, four ba uh, Battle VIP Pass <laughs> to get some stuff onto our bench turn one, four Level Ball, four Fog Crystals, two Super Rods, two Ultra Ball, and two rare candies, uh, another couple of gust cards, two counter catcher, and then three stadiums to bump those pesky paths to the peaks, one collapsed, and two moonlit hills, along with ten basic psychic and two reversal energies. So that is exactly what our deck list consists of. Let's put it in play, put it in action, and put up some wins. Let's get it going. Alright, we play Pendorax. Or Pandora X. Interesting. Alright, our opponent won the coin flip. That's fine. Let's see what we can do. Ah, our opponent will go first. That's fine. Mmm, ooh, this is not good. We'll have to... Oh... We have no... Ooh, we're in top deck mode right off the bat. Yikes. Okay, Mimikyu's not bad, but they can one-shot this Manaphy if we don't get anything. Yikes. Okay, um, we might just get donked here. Okay, Fog Crystal. Alright, there we go. Okay. Please don't have a boss. <laughs> if they have boss energy, I'm going to cry. Because we have the Mirage Step Curlia in hand. That's fine. I will... Fine. That's totally fine. <laughs> That's fine. That's what I wanted. Mirage Step. Oh, only two more Curlias? Oof. Okay. One's prized, then. Okay. I am gonna have to hit an energy off of Shining Arcana. 140. Oof. Yeah. Covert Flight can knock us out. <sighs> For Seal Stone. Okay. Well, first things first, Guard of War. Hmm. I don't. I, boss doesn't do anything right now, and I want to keep the rest as options. Battle VIP. Okay. Let's get Waltz in here. Can we hit anything off Shining Arcana? 
No, but we hit worker. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay. Um. Oh, actually. There we go. We actually did get the knockout. That's this is fine. Um Scream Tail. Yep, this is fine. Okay. After a rocky after a rough start, I did forget that the reversal energy was activated. So we can for sure um, hopefully they don't have another path. Um, the bad thing is, though, if they have a psychic energy, there it is, then they are knocking out the Gardevoir. Ooh, are they gonna get back path to the peak? Probably. Because Mimikyu wouldn't do anything. Oh, what? They got back Mimikyu Darkness? No, that's not going to do anything. Okay, I mean, fine, fine. Alright, Curlia. Okay, I want to keep that. So let's Cresselia. Mm. Let's get back Boom Boom Boom. Let's get another waltz. We will refinement away a psychic. Let's get miraged up Curlia. Let's refinement. Jeez. All right. Well. We didn't get anything. Jeez, okay, no supporters, no Gardevoir EX, no Baby Guardy, nothing. They are going to have to use Dominating Echo. Okay, so we... Okay. Okay, we could counter catcher. That is true. Let's put the Ralts down. Let's get rid of four seal stone. There we go. Okay. Um that doesn't help us. Honestly. Uh, kind of it does. Shining Arcana. There we go. <laughs> That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted. Okay. So let's Psychic Embrace. Boom. This is not going to be for a knockout, but I want to do as much damage on it as possible. Oh, we were one energy off. Shoot! <laughs> that's fine, that's fine. We can take it out with anything then. Yeah, man, after a rough start, uh, we finally got a Gardevoir EX in play. We can KO it with Screamtail, with Cresselia, even. Actually, I like that. I like it. Let's go Cresselia. B 
because Mimikyu can't KO Cresselia, and then I'll just be able to Lunar Blast for the knockout on that. So, unless they play something else, we're, we're pretty good. We're pretty good. They are down to two prize cards, though, so we got that in the nick of time. Very much in the nick of time. All right, let's Gardevoir. We'll go Cresselia, Curlia. Not doing anything on the Screamtail, because I don't want that energy to be just healed. So one energy on everything. We're done. Second energy on Cresselia, why not? Just in case of a Path to the Peak and Moon Glow Reverse. 80 damage. And if they play Path to the Peak and we can't accelerate energies, that's why I played the second one on Cresselia, so I can play just the reversal for the colorless energy and just go for Lunar Blast. So, we're looking pretty good. Yep, there's the Path to the Peak play. If that wasn't the case, then I would have had to wait an extra turn, so that is why I did that. They had a, we had a slow start, they had a quick one, but it looks like we were able to fish the win out of the bottom of the depths of our deck. <laughs> Just barely. Ooh. Unless they have like a Noibat or a no yeah, a Noibat and a you know, a psychic or dark something, but we did have the collapse in hand as well, so they would have they have to path Iono Noibat to keep this game going. Yeah. Scoop! We win! <laughs> Alright. GG's. All right, we are playing Emo Anthony. Let's see what we got. Uh, yep, I definitely want to go first. Let's see here. Okay, well, we do start with overall, so that's not terrible. Um... We're not going to be able to get multiple rolls down unless we top deck like a Radiant Greninja or Level Ball, something like that. Hopefully something to get us Battle VIP, that'd be sick. Ooh, Iron Hands, we definitely want to take care of that ASAP. So let's get another Ralts. And let's go get a second energy on that. Okay. So yeah, let's see what my opponent can do. Maybe it's Miraidon or maybe it's something else. Hopefully the Iron Hands is stuck in the active. Ooh, is it Chin Pao? Interesting, it might be Chin Pao. It's probably Chin Pao Battle VIP. Ooh, no, Radiant. Okay, same, same diff, same diff. Radiant Greninja Battle VIP. Okay. So, yeah, they already have th uh, the Lightning Energy on, so I definitely am worried about them getting a Backscalibur. The only thing is they can't guarantee energies because Chin Pao hasn't been in the active to do that, but they already have two out of the three that they need if they have the superior energy retrieval. So that could be huge. Mm. Okay, a third Ralts. Let's see what Worker has for us. Okay, that's actually pretty good. Hmm... Uh, 
oh, I'm actually, I'm actually gonna do that. I can two shot. I can two shot this Iron Hands EX. It's better I do that than anything else. So that's actually fine. Because Iron Hands can't one shot my Gardevoir EX. Okay, this is decent. Good start by us, lame start by my opponent. Excalibur. Ooh, do they have the rare candy or do they have? Yep, so they did already have it without having to use the Beeberill. But do they have a superior energy retrieval? They have four in the discard. More than enough. But if I can take out this Iron Hands without them being able to do anything. That'd be pretty sick. No energy in the discard, though. Do they have a way to switch out? Okay, Emo Anthony, let's see what you... Ooh, Irida, okay. Are they going to do, like, escape rope, or what? Earthen Vessel, ooh, okay. Earthen Vessel could get two energies, at least, so they could swing with arm press if they really want to. Or not. Just draw more cards. Okay. Yeah, whenever you're playing Chin Pao and they start with Iron Hands, it's, it's pretty good. I think just to help myself get a better setup, if I... Ooh, they do have a superior energy retrieval. So they are going to waste one. So they have five energy in hand, because... But do they have a switch? They could KO me. If they could get rid of six energy, but right now they don't have any waters in play. So all six would have to be... No, they, they can't do it. Because all six would have to be waters, but then there would be no switch out. So are they just going to swing into me with iron hands? Okay, one, two, and then the rest on... Yep, I definitely need the mana fee down. 120 is all... Why would you amp you very much? Oh, you can't do arm press. Oh, that's true. Alright. Well, let's Moonlit Hill heal a little bit. And then I will star alchemy, actually, for Irida. Or Iono, I'm sorry. Oh, are you joking me? <laughs> well, let's go get Screamtail. Because <laughs> I don't want to be... Yeah, let's retreat. Let's add the energy. And then we will Psychic Embrace. Yeah, not, not exactly what I wanted. I wanted at least maybe... Um, Yeah. Anyways, I wanted at least maybe, uh, you know, a curly or two. <laughs> but anyways, we will take the two prizes. 
Well, another Iono. Okay, we don't need another Gardevoir EX. Um, unless they... <sighs> yep, this is what I... This is what I was really, really hoping against. Because they're going to knock out both Ralts. So, that's not good. Unless they're, they, unless they're going one Screamtail, one Ralts, but... Yeah, maybe one Screamtail, one Ralts. I don't know. We'll see. I guess it's good that I'm not wasting Curlias on... Uh, yeah, I didn't get the Manaphy. But at least I didn't... Um, I didn't waste Curlias. I could... I don't have any more Ralts down. I would need a... I would need a... A Super Rod. So hopefully they take out just the Screamtail and the Ralts, but we'll see. Ooh, three? Jeez. Three items. Okay, are they going for a second Beeberl or a second Excalibur? Okay, okay. They're definitely getting two prizes. They're tying up the prize trade right now, for sure. Are they going Ralts, Ralts, or Screamtail, Ralts? Yep, Ralts, Ralts, okay. Fine by me, I guess. Uh. Oh, and there's a Curlia. Shoot, okay. Right now it's doing 80. Right? 20 damage for each damage counter on this Pokemon. So I could take out their Rexcalibur here. I like that. Psychic Embrace. One. Two. I'll attach this. Collapse Stadium. So they have to get rid of probably the Bidoof, which is fine. Yep. Alright. Iono. Come on. Get me a Super Rod. Ah, well, there's the Manaphy. And then I'll Roaring Scream. 160 onto the Backscalibur. And another Curlia. Yeesh, okay. So what can my opponent do with an Ionode hand? Okay, so they do have another Pokestop. Can they get into another Irida or nothing? Okay, that's pretty good. But here's the thing. We do have Fog Crystal Boss for another... To boss up their um, Backscalibur, so we this was a kind of a broken game, you know. We, we didn't get the Manaphy in time, but we were able to squeak things out with getting the Iron Hands KO'd and then their Backscalibur. So, are they just going to swing and knock out the Screamtail? That'd actually be pretty sick. Um, oh, they do Irida. Okay. We'll see what they do. Are they going to Rare Candy back Excalibur? So the boss play does stick. Um, I would, I really, really want a, because this is three out of my four Ralts, and the other one's actually prized. Yep. So they must have the Bexcalibur already in hand, unless they don't. They do they? How many Bexcalibers are gone? Only one. Is the other one prized? 
Did they price their other Excalibur? Oh, they did. Oh, snap. Snap. They prized their other Excalibur. Okay. Well, I have to... I'm on odd prizes anyways, so... I have to KO a single prize anyways, so... Let's go Fog Crystal. Boss. And let's see if we can snag a um, Super Rod. Yeah, okay. There we go. There we go. So let's go Double Curlia... Or Double Ralts Screamtail. And then we will Miracle Force. Alright, so Chin Pao is the only thing. Oh, there's the other Ralts. Fantastic. We only need to KO one Chin Pao, and they are working with one energy attachment per turn. So they can do 120 to us, which would be 210. But that's about it. Nest Ball. They have five cards left in deck. Superior Energy Retrieval doesn't super help them. Oh, they ditch Double Cross Switcher? Oh, no. Okay, okay. Ooh, okay, Hasui and Heavy Ball. And, yeah, no more, no more, um, Frigibacks. Yep, just that one right there. They have... Ooh, they do double Cross Switcher. So they had four Cross Switchers in their hand. No way. <laughs> and they bring up the Zacian? Why? I guess because it has a 2 energy retreat cost, but we have 5 in the discard. We can just get it. Yeah, they're really trying to work at this. Oh, and they Iono us. Darn. Okay, we had a Ralts and a Curlia in hand. Dang it. That really doesn't help. Yeah, double Frigibax. Woof. And Super Rod. Are they going to bring back the Bexcalibur? Or no. Interesting. Are they going to bring... Oh, no. That's just another Jin Pao. Okay. Man, we are really down. Shoot. <laughs> Counter catcher doesn't work. Okay. Well, let's swing with Pokestop. Let's see what we got. Oh, no. Okay, so we got... We can get a Ralts. That's about it. <laughs> okay, Psychic Embrace. Let's go one... Yeah, I only need three energy because that would be 150, so that can kill, that can KO a Radiant Greninja. Man, this is, <laughs> this is such a w weird game. Like, neither of us got really super set up, and so it was just like, who could scrounge together, um, who could scrounge together some knockouts. <laughs> Jeez. I mean, Level Ball can guarantee a, a Curlia, but... Oh my gosh, did they get it? Did they get a Rare Candy Bexcalibur? How many Rare Candies do, do they play? They've only played one, okay. But they've already... Shoot, okay, they've already done Bibarel. Do they have any left in deck? They have two left in deck? Oh! <gasps> Yo! One, two, okay, they... Oh, they have four. So three out of the four of the... Oh, no, I win. There's no way. They, they can't put anything left back, and they could get two... Uh, it depends how many of these are going to be energy cards. Or is there superior energy retrievals left? There's still one left. 
Shoot. Okay. Here it comes. Gardevoir? There we go. That was the perfect top deck. Um, let's level ball. Oh, actually, let's just level ball for the Screamtail. What am I doing? I'm like, oh, I don't even need Gardevoir. Okay, Screamtail. We ditch. We get Screamtail. I was, I was like, oh, we have to see if there's that many energy. No, 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 we got it. So I can embrace to the Screamtail and knock out their... Frigibax. Scoop! Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> there we go. There we go. We got him! <laughs> Gardevoir, still king of the hill. Well, alrighty, folks, thank you so much for watching the video and for the small amount of times that we did use Moonlit Hill. It is pretty good if you're going to be pairing it with either Baby Gardevoir or Zacian just to get a couple more energies without needing to, you know, put Luxurious Cape on or something like that, or even without needing a reversal energy. So that could come in handy. One heal could put two extra energy on either of those Pokemon. So please use it that it does pair really, really well uh, with Gardevoir. So I cannot believe that, you know, Gardevoir got another boost, but you know what? Sometimes, you know, they do like to uh, buff up the BDIFs. So in any case, thank you so much for watching. Please, please like and subscribe. And until next time, this is the Machamp King. You all have a nice day. Peace.